More than ever, homeowners are looking for solutions to protect themselves against blackouts. This is particularly true here in California lately, where planned shutoffs by utilities to prevent forest fires have affected tens of thousands of people. Traditionally, homeowners have looked to backup generators to protect themselves against grid outages. These days, however, modern technology has fundamentally transform this market and state-of-the-art batteries offer a far better alternative to home backup than a generator does. But before I tell you 10 reasons why batteries are better than generators, please take a second to subscribe to the channel by clicking the button down below. In case you haven't heard one before, here's what a traditional backup generator sounds like. It does quiet down some when you close the lid, as you can see. And you can actually see the exhaust on this side going away from the house. Generators are horrifically noisy and their unpleasant bother lasts as long as the outage persists, which can be multiple hours, if not days. By contrast, batteries are completely silent. You wouldn't be able to tell that your battery was powering your home if you were standing right next to it. Your family and your neighbors will thank you for keeping the peace. Diesel generators emit nitrous oxide, carbon monoxide, particulate matter, and other hydrocarbons. Propane and natural gas generators emit dangerous emissions as well. We all know how dangerous it would be to lock yourself or your family in your garage with the car running. So the thought of a generator's emission right next to your home should be similarly unappealing. In fact, generator emissions can be so dangerous that carbon monoxide poisoning from using generators can kill more people than the natural disasters they're designed to protect us from. Batteries, of course, emit no emissions of any kind. They're completely sealed and will have no negative impact on your family's health. While some portable generators can be quite small, built-in generators, which more closely match the capabilities of home batteries, occupy a much larger footprint and can take up valuable space in your side yard or backyard. If you install one of these generators, you'll likely also need to pour a substantial concrete pad near it or under it, I should say, if there was, isn't one already. Home batteries, meanwhile, are wall mounted or garage mounted and do not require any such construction work. They only stand a few inches away from the wall and can sit comfortably alongside your solar equipment garage solving, etc. Even the best backup generators on the market take a few seconds to cycle up in the event of an outage. This delay can leave young children scared, make clocks and devices reset, and cause unnecessary stress. If you have a portable generator that needs to be hooked up manually, the outage can last minutes. By contrast though, Batteries are almost instant on. They can react to outages in fractions of a second, so quickly that clocks often won't even blink. In fact, Tesla ran into a problem with its power wall wherein the batteries kicked in so fast that homeowners didn't even know that they had lost power. As a result, Tesla updated its mobile app to send a notification alerting homeowners that an outage had occurred. One of the biggest draws of electric vehicles is that they don't require the expensive regular maintenance that is internal combustion engines do. With EVs, 
you don't have to worry about oil changes or anything like that because that's a thing of the past. Similarly, batteries require far less maintenance than a generator does. Typically, generators need to cycle at least once per month to make sure all the internal components are lubricated and operating properly. Most homeowners will also hire a technician to inspect the generator every year to make sure it's in good working order. After all, the only thing worse than paying for a generator is having it fail to turn on when you need it the most. Batteries, on the other hand, require no maintenance of any kind, other than maybe the occasional surface cleaning with some, uh, you know, 409. Uh, the battery will not require maintenance throughout its entire service life, realistically. You can rest assured that it will always be ready to protect you and your family at a moment's notice. After an earthquake, one of the first things the local utility company will do is shut off natural gas services to prevent any potential fires from ruptured gas lines. If you're in an earthquake prone area like California, this can completely negate the benefit of having a built-in gas standby generator as its fuel supply will be shut off immediately. Of course, batteries do not experience this issue. Most generators are limited in backup duration by the amount of fuel you have on hand. Once your supply of diesel or propane runs out, the generator will stop and leave you without power. Admittedly, natural gas generators fed by an underground line typically don't experience this issue, except for the previously mentioned instance of an earthquake. Diesel and propane generators do, however. By contrast, batteries paired with solar panels can run basically forever. By setting your household consumption equal to your solar system's daily output, your battery will continue to recharge itself and you could theoretically run without grid power forever. A backup generator is only useful to you when you have a power outage. Even if we assume that you have three full days without power every year, that's a full 72 hours, that's still less than 1% of the time. That means you're spending thousands of dollars for a solution that provides extremely limited benefits from a long-term perspective. Solar systems with battery backup, however, operate every single day of the year and will save you money the other 99% of the time you're living your life because you're reducing, if not eliminating, your electric bill. Oh, and when you do lose power, guess what? the battery takes over and continues to operate the solar and your home. Most homeowners are attracted to the idea of being energy independent. Producing your own power while reducing dependence on the electric grid appeals to the American ideal of self-resilience. While generators leave you completely reliant on the electric grid for your power, the combination of solar and batteries allows you to produce, store, and use your own electricity, dramatically reducing your dependence on the utility company. Generators are what you would call dumb devices that have no interoperability with the electric grid. As far as the electric utility company is concerned, it makes no difference whether you have a generator or not to them. Batteries, however, are smart devices capable of dispensing power instantaneously as needed. While that is helpful for homeowners today, tomorrow's utility companies find that capability very intriguing. Vermont's Green Mountain Power already pays homeowners to install backup batteries, and other utility companies will surely follow. Combined with current incentives like the tax credit from the federal government or the California's SGIP program, batteries will become increasingly more affordable for homeowners every day. Homeowners will increasingly look to batteries rather than generators to meet their backup needs. And for the sake of public health and fighting climate change, that's a very good thing. 
If you're interested in getting more information on a battery backup system for your home, head over to our website and schedule a complimentary call with one of our energy specialists. Our experts can answer all of your questions about batteries or solar systems and help find the right solution. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to the channel. Until next time.